Hey, Chili from Best Buy Canada's blog, and this week I've been testing out Bodum coffee accessories. I've got quite a few different Bodum coffee accessories in front of me. Um, I have the Bodum iced coffee carafe. I have the Bodum French press. The Bodum pour over with a really cool uh, felt and leather strap. And I have the Bodum French press travel mug. The first Bodum coffee accessory I'm going to show you is the Bodum pour over. I just love how this pour over looks. You can see that it has a leather strap and a reusable filter. So to use the pour over, all you do is you take one of the included scoops. You scoop out as much coffee as you need. For each four ounce cup of water, you're going to use two of these scoops of coffee. So I've got my coffee inside the pour over and I'm going to pour over my water. You try to do it in a circular motion around the edges. And when the water is done dripping through, you take your filter off and you can discard your coffee grinds. If you look down into your carafe, you've got hot coffee. And then you add this plunger and it's ready to serve. This leather strap will pull off and you can remove this cone cover and this can go in the dishwasher so it's easy to clean too. Next up I'm going to make some coffee in the Bodum French Press. Um, as you can see the Bodum French Press comes with two parts. There's the plunger and there's the glass carafe. To make coffee in this, and this is one of the most delicious ways to make coffee, you add your grinds to the bottom of the French press and you can add as many or as little as you like. There's instructions online for making French press coffee. I tend to like mine strong so if I'm going to add um, eight ounces of water I'm going to add a couple of scoops of the coffee. I find that if you add four ounces of water with one scoop it's, it's just too weak. So I'm going to fill my French press up about halfway with boiled water it should be hot, but not boiling. And I've placed the lid on, and now you have to let it steep for approximately four minutes. All right, so it's been about four minutes, and uh, then you just take this plunger, and you slowly push it down. Very slowly. Once the plunger reaches the bottom, you have an amazing cup of coffee. So to use the Bodum Iced Coffee Maker, you add your coffee. There's an included scoop. You can measure out how much. Um, I think it's similar uh, as to... Um, so when you've, you've got your grinds, I've added quite a few grinds, um, just because that's a huge pot of coffee. Then you add ice cold water, slowly. And now I'm going to pop the lid on. This is the fridge lid. And I'm going to put this in my fridge for 24 hours. So when I'm done and I pull it back out, then you pop off the fridge lid. And you'll have a nice um, steeped coffee inside of there. It'll be ice cold. And you put the plunger on just like you would a French press. 
and you push it on and you push it down to the bottom and then you're ready to pour. Having a jug of iced coffee in your fridge is really amazing. You can add a uh, latte, uh, like you can make lattes out of it. You can add um, vanilla syrup or just milk or just drink it straight like a cold brew. And it is a very refreshing treat on a hot day. But not least, we have the Bodum Travel French Press. This is such a cool idea. I can't believe I've never seen this before. This is a travel mug with a French press built in. So all you have to do is add your coffee to the bottom and let it steep for four minutes and then plunge it and you're ready to drink. And you don't have to do anything. You can leave the grinds inside there and just drink from the travel mug. So I'm just going to add some grinds to the travel mug. It's quite a tall mug. And as I've said, I like coffee strong. And then you fill it up with hot water. And now I'm going to let it steep for four minutes. So now it's been four minutes and I'm just going to push the plunger in. You won't be able to see it like you would in a glass carafe. But as long as it's going down, as you can see, the plunger is all the way down. Now I'm just going to tighten the lid. And once the lid is tight, you can just pop this off, snaps down, and you can drink coffee. So I've tested out all of the Bodum products that I've got here today, and uh, now I get to just enjoy all of the coffee I made. You can see my full review of these Bodum products on Best Buy Canada's blog. Thanks for watching.